Cinderella Fairy Tale Part 3 The Ball At the ball, the prince was despondent. Why do you have that sad look on your face? The queen said to her son. Look around you, you could not ask for finer maidens than these. I know mother, said the prince. Yet something was wrong, he had met many of these young women. Yet after he said hello to each one, he could find nothing more to say. Look, someone pointed to the front door. Who is that? All heads turned. Who was that lovely maiden stepping down the stairs? She held her head tall and looked as if she belonged. But no one knew her. There is something about that young lady, said the prince to himself. I will ask her to dance. And he walked over to Cinderella. Have we met? Said the prince. I am pleased to meet you now, said Cinderella with a bow. Yet I feel as if I know you, said the prince. Of course. That is impossible. Many things are possible, said Cinderella, if you wish them to be true. Do you really believe that? Said the prince. I know it, said Cinderella. The prince felt a leap in his heart. He and Cinderella danced. When the song was over, they danced again. And then they danced again, and yet again. Soon the other maidens at the ball grew jealous. Why is he dancing all the time with her? They said, how rude. But all the prince could see was Cinderella. They laughed and talked, and they danced some more. In fact, they danced for so long that Cinderella did not see the clock.